you know, it's like uh, 722. Um, all right. <laughs> Secretary's report. Gabriel, when we went to Disney, conquered Mount Everest. Loved it. Minutes? Have any minutes? To I, I, I know, John I does. sent them out. And did everyone read the minutes? I did. Where did you send them? Motion to approve John's minutes. So Second. All in favor? Aye. 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 There you go. Your minutes are gone. Okay. Vendors. <coughs> we are up to 58 vendors. We have a few pending. Some people <coughs> like to uh, email me their application, and then I kindly email them back saying no applications are processed without the full application along with a check. And one of them finally sent me the check since May. It's, it is what it is. They just, that's about, I received one the other day that has to have all the safe serve, everything else with it, and why you, I need to know why you need electric, because he wants to know why you need electric. Won't answer emails. I'm, it, okay then, moving on. Because the application does say that we do not accept email applications. So, there you go. To that point, I reached out to uh, a friend of mine who does uh, print making. He's a custom printmaker mm -hmm. in Connecticut. Did you get his stuff? Paprika Press? Nope. Not yet. Um, said, hey, you should submit a vendor form. We don't have anything like that. People are just looking for new, new vendors. I said, great. Uh, and then he went online and read all the instructions and his paper and everything. We should consider updating our process and bring it into the 21st century. What did you say he does again? Printing on t-shirts? Yeah. Printing. Uh, it's pr printmaking. This printmaking. On okay. paper. Any? Oh, okay. Yeah, but he accepts uh, digital uh, sales. Um, anyway, he was he would mention like, you know, this is kind of a pain hassle to print it out and send it in everything. So Really? Really? Yeah. Everyone else is okay, going here's, 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 <laughs> here's the issue with not having it come in the mail, though. Yeah. Okay. We're going to get a whole bunch of applications, and they won't give us any money. I know. Yeah. I know. Yeah. I, I know. I know. I understand. Mm -hmm. We should put our heads together and see if we can come up with a solution. Yeah. The only solution to that is for us to sign up for a service where we can take payment online. Yes. Yeah. The problem with that, okay, is that, is that we only do it one month a year. Mm -hmm. but there's a fee per month by doing that. So well, it, it, it there's another issue too, it. which is if you accept payment online, then it, once you accept payment, you have a contract. That's right. So, yeah, that's another thing. You would, I mean, you you would almost have to say we approve the contract. Please, please send payment within yeah. X days. It's not. We're not. We're not the only ones to do it this way. Woodstock Fair still does it this way. Yeah. Yeah. Brentford Field Fair. I mean, there's a lot of it. It's antiquated. It is. But a lot of the antiquated festivals do it. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's yeah. that's not a reason that we should continue doing it. All I'm saying is that we should yeah. see if we could figure out a way, try to find a way to digitize the process. And for those folks who have done this for 100 years and still want to print it out, can we send it in? We can do it that way, and then as we're looking towards the future and getting vendors who are more modern, we um, might want to appease them. But then, on a, another note, because I do vendor shows myself, not many, but anyway, they're all still the other way, and but it makes me sit back and think, you don't want to print up the application and send you in your check and stick a stamp, I'm sorry, it costs you an envelope and a stamp, um, but do you want to participate? And if you can't be bothered to do that, then I'm thinking you don't want to participate. Well, we almost lost a vendor, a, a high quality vendor in Eric and Paprika Press because of the process. Good. He, yeah. so he didn't want to come because he has to fill out a form? Yeah. Really? Then I don't want them. Come on. I mean, that's... Well, that's I'm cat. just... 
It's absurd. No, 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 no. It's absurd. No, hold on. No, hear me out. Hear me out. This is this is ridiculous. Like he, we want people like him, and we want to make we want to make it easy for folks who are good, good new vendors to join our our event. Mm -hmm. We don't want to turn people away because of the process. We don't want people to be dissuaded by the process. So to, to John's point, if I have to pay a bill by a check now, mm -hmm. like for me to have to try and find my checkbook is annoying. <laughs> like I just don't do it, right? Like it, it, I don't, I can't remember the last time I wrote a check. Yeah. You know, it, it's just one of those things that you know, it, it, and we're, we're not going to tackle this year. This year, so it's really not even worth talking about. Um, but you know, I, I think you know, to, to John's point, whether it's like Venmo or you know PayPal or you know whatever it happens to be, there's there's probably you know something that we can do to to make not the process easier. And I don't think that's the right word that, that John's maybe looking for, but to make it um, in the currency that people use today. So, you know, like right now, all my stuff is done on BillPay, right? I go on, you know, my, my bank's website, click, click, off it goes. Yeah, but any, I use... Any contract that I sign yeah, now but, uh, is time all for a second. easy. Okay. You use BillPay, right? <clears throat> yep. Okay. What is bill pay? Bill pay will cut a check yeah, yeah. and send no, it off. send a check. I yeah. get it. Yeah, they do it. I, but that yeah. wouldn't work for our process. No, that wouldn't not. because you wouldn't be sending a check at the same time as your contract. It doesn't matter. If if we were doing if we, they were doing it that way, and then if they if they emailed the application, okay, and the check came from bill pay, then we'll process it as soon as the two marry up. I'm. I just think that the process could be more thoughtful. Michael be, Fitzpatrick. Um, okay. And from what I've heard, it, at least this is the feedback that I got a while back from Town Hall mm -hmm. when I would use bill pay to pay my taxes. Mm -hmm. They're like, you're lucky this ever gets applied. Because <laughs> it's just like, there's not enough info on the checks. Actually, this is a reason I hate checks. In my company right now, I still predominantly work in, I, I do a lot, of, a lot of checks. And we'll call them amateur checks, which are, you know, Billy and Sue are getting married and they send me a check for their wedding. They hardly ever, like, put the detail that I need in order to properly apply it. So if you're getting the contract with your check, that's fine, right? You know exactly where it goes. If if the check comes sometimes sometime later, mm -hmm. then, oh, I didn't get my check. Maybe. Maybe I did. Maybe I didn't. You got some weird last name on here that you didn't use before or some trust, and now I'm trying to figure out where it goes. So I got a mystery check here, and I figure at some point someone's going to call me and say, why didn't it get applied? Or I'm going to call you and say, why didn't you pay? And be like, what? what do you mean? So... Like I said, I don't think this is worth spending time on right now, um, but we we look at all of our processes every year, and yeah, we should probably look at this one in the future and then decide if you know may or may not want to change it. Maybe it's worth the hassle. Maybe it's not. Yeah. Maybe maybe there's a convenience fee that's charged for doing online. Maybe there's not. I don't know. But. I don't think it should necessarily be just a dead topic. And we'll have to this. investigate it further. I just don't <coughs> want situations of they processed it that way and then changed their mind, or there was a glitch or whatever. But also, it it very it it highly disappoints me that that person felt that way. That yeah, we're still doing it the old-fashioned way, and we can't do anything about it this year. So um, look, look at it from their perspective, though. It, they've, they've never been to our event. They've mm -hmm. never participated in our event. John is reaching out and saying, hey, you should do this. So going in blind, they don't know that we have 
you know what what the event looks like on a normal year you know so it's like oh, that's I'm not what going the Facebook this, so. and web page is for you could talk to John who he knows but you're still going off oh my, my buddy said this was a good thing right right but it disappoints me that you wouldn't even consider possibly all right for this year do it the way they want it to be done he, he, and request for no, it to he, be different. He is. He he is. is. He's going to. It's but just it's a barrier of entry, and I'm, I'm passing the thing back forward. All right. Okay. okay. We have to investigate further. Okay. All right. Um, I will state that we received a thank you from our... Oh, damn time. Really? Well, I don't know who it's from, but it's about time we Came in in July. You. It's from... <laughs> <laughs> the scholarship winner. Thank you for awarding oh. me the Douglas October Fist Scholarship for 2021. It is much appreciated and a great honor. Wow. So there's that. And it did come in quite quickly, a month after he graduated. So that that's, really nice. yeah, that's all I have to say about that, I think. Vendors is always interesting. We'll just go with that. <clears throat> I, I, I do vendors with a sense of humor, and if I really, I go, really? He'll be like, okay, what happened? But other than that, it's just a few usual. So I approach my job every day. I, I yeah. got a phone call today from Gary Vecchioni about his ice cream truck. Okay. Now, we had mentioned in one of the previous meetings that uh, somebody wanted an ice cream. Yeah, we're going to put an ice cream truck over by um, Stage C, the mm -hmm. Olive Branch Lodge. Can't the Olive Branch Lodge. That was the plan, was yeah. to park it up there. Yeah, because um, it can't be on Main Street. Mm -hmm. that. Anyway, the idea, anyway, he asked me if, uh, no, we had planned it. I asked him if he sold salsa of ice cream, because that's generally one of the, you know, one of the, and, but he doesn't do that. He just sells Who does? the novelty stuff. Huh? Who does? I don't know. You, I, I wasn't charted to look for an ice cream Wasn't guy. there a name? Did somebody have a name of somebody to check out for an ice cream truck? Gary Vecchioni, Vecchioni has lived in town for all, and he has the ice cream truck that has the novelty ice creams. They're, they're all pre-packaged. We, we, we know who he is. Okay. Yeah. Are there any, does anyone have names of other ice cream trucks? No. Well, what's the goal? The ice is cream... Uh, sweet wines. Yeah, yeah. What's the goal of the ice cream truck? I mean, other than to sell ice cream, but you don't want just novelties. You want them no. to be able to make like an ice cream sundae or something like that, right? That's what I think. That's what you envision. Yeah, I did. I that would be better. It would, sure. you know, um, than just novelties. <coughs> um, yeah, I agree. I think that'd be nice. I'll reach out to this. Originally, yeah, I originally, I don't, I don't know if they do. Originally, this idea kind of kicked around because. If we're selling soda, then ice cream and you know, a yeah. scoop of ice cream in your soda can be a good thing. Yeah, you know? and I, I just so. also think it would be good to be like around the rib competition to have ice cream up there. You know, plus it's the trains going by and seeing the ice cream. Mm -hmm. We have good. to be careful with our food and trucks because we have yeah. a our own Oktoberfest rule that says no food truck vendors. And we've had that for a while. I mean, because we can't put them on Main Street. Yeah, and, well, we do have the French fry people. You know, we can put people on that on Pleasant Street. Um, well, we're we're going we're going to put them like, up by that stage up there. Like that that was. Yeah, where would we put it on? Up, yeah, up by the stage isn't really definitive. It really because we have a lot of stuff going <coughs> around there. I think, um, yeah, a couple of thoughts. One is there's enough room, I think, in the Y. In the turn? Yeah, the turn mm -hmm. to park it up there. Um, do we have anything in that, in the church lot, parking yes. lot yet? We do. No, not the lot. Where the you're lot. walking up the street, the side of the church has a big dirt area yeah. that's like three vendor sites. Yeah. That's taken. But they've got the paved section. Yeah. So the paved that section. Could be another idea. Well, the paved section was we were kind of reserving that so that we could put some seating for the stage, right? You have to talk with the church as well about that's their parking space. They don't park there, though. No. Oh, okay. Yeah, they know that we park there. Um, yeah, so somewhere up there. 
So is the idea still to put stage seating for the stage there? Yeah, but I, th I thought we were going to do more on the grass and less of that paved section. Well, uh, you don't have much grass now because there's a tree that took yeah. up the middle of it. So if we w the idea was is that we were going to make a stage with hay bales or something rather than a formal yes. stage. That would be nice. By doing it? that, though, um, the stage wasn't going to be hay bales. There's not, you know, when you if you make it, was be no, I think we were going to do on the ground. That's what we came to. Yeah, on it, the ground, but the, yeah. the, you don't want you don't want. They people. wouldn't be standing on hay bales. Yeah, we're going to put out a whole bunch of hay bales. Yeah, form of hay right. Bales. No, okay. just like a backdrop or something. Okay, but I, I thought we were going to use like the hay bales for seating. Yes, that's. I can okay. I can still put the platform in there. No, I no, think we're trying to avoid putting the platform out. Okay, but one of the hay I'm bales. Getting old and tired of carrying those damn things. <laughs> so we'll have performers <laughs> play on the ground. <laughs> yeah. And we'll put some hay bales in front and behind them. For what? what ambiance. Okay, ambiance. And then well, uh, seating. Can, well, you don't want people seating, sitting on hay bales. Keep you don't want people sitting on They will not hay survive. <laughs> the hay bales or the people? The, the, the hay bales. Okay, so you'll be, you'll be raking it up. I want, I want your truck. You want my truck? I want your truck. Your truck is a stage. The old truck. My old truck has Pops, a stage. Pops truck. <laughs> I, saw, I saw Big John Short the other day at Timber Timber something brewing. And he was using a, a truck as a, a stage? There was a truck, right? It was an old truck, you know, and it was from a timber yard. Two, yeah, two, timber yard, I think it was. Timber yard brewing. Really cool. And so they, took the, they took the bed off the back of the truck. Yeah. Right, and, and put, like and they basically built like a stage on the back of the truck. Really? Yeah. Is he coming back? I have Try. I have a trailer that we could ah. do that too. Okay, fine. You have a what? I have a trailer that we could do that too. It's a big <coughs> trailer. The one in the backyard? Yeah, we could turn that into a stage. We could do that. After after I use it to take to take the barrel train down. Yeah. Yeah. I mean, it'd make it easier to move the stage down. It's, it's big enough to hold a car, so yeah. it's big enough to be a stage. <laughs> it no? looks cool with a truck, that's all I'm saying. Well, I'm, I'm sure, sure it does. You don't want to get over... I'm just saying we're we're against the clock here for new ideas. Yeah, yeah. yeah. yeah you're right. Like, new ideas happen in... Yeah. The like, only, in my my point is, though, is that you, you really don't want to use hay bales for seating. Okay. So no seating. What do you want to have people sit on? I can I can I can get tables and chairs delivered so that they have them. Is there enough? Okay. So yes, and we talked about putting some food towards that area then, right? So that there's gives people a reason to sit down with tables and chairs. Well, if you have an ice cream truck, ice cream. Okay, there's one. Okay. Yep. Okay. And then. Okay. Mm -hmm. <coughs> and then, then, conceivably, you know, we could have more stuff up Pleasant Street. We're, we're oh, thinking yeah. of that. Push food vendors further up Pleasant Street. I'm going to push the French fry person up as far as I can get him in his rig. Okay. <laughs> um, and They'll then, make it up the hill. Yeah. <laughs> okay, that's fine. So we'll do some tables and chairs. Yeah. Tables and chairs up there. Yeah. Has anyone talked to the Olive Lodge people? It had been mentioned to them to possibly consider serving German food. Have we heard back from that? We, when we went and saw them and we were discussing the thing, there was a person in there that said he was going to consider making that if somebody helped him. I don't remember his name. I thought they kind of commissioned that idea. But Do you have a contact over there I can call? Yeah, still thinking of serving German food. So, back to the stage. We'll have people perform on the ground. Okay. With some hay bales for ambiance. We'll just set up some in front of them, behind them, kind of make a stage. Mm -hmm. Stack a couple up. So we want to put an awning up and stuff for them to be under. And, no? Yes? I say no awning. No wanting. What happens if we get drizzled with rain? 
I say we do it on it. <laughs> you have to weight it down because you can't. Yeah. Because I need two up there because I need one for the sound guy. Yeah. Yeah. For the band. Typically, yeah. typically that's what we had up there. Only that yeah. I had a stage under one of them. Yeah. Do you remember? Yeah. Yeah. So the only thing that you're doing is is you're taking the platform away. Yes. Hmm. So the stage isn't bigger than it was last time. It's the same size. Yes. Then, so down the other side, the the junk store side. I mean the goodness store side. Yeah. I'm not setting that stage up. Yeah, I need the small stage. So you want the small stage there? Yes. Okay. I don't have enough awnings for that because the small stage is going to need two awnings as well. We don't have enough easy ups? I don't believe so. Almost every game, every game has, has one. an awning because yeah. sometimes it just gets too miserable and hot. Okay. So I might want the big stage down there. It's going to depend on if I get an act. Okay. So, so the normal stage that once goes down. Maybe. Okay. And it's going to depend on if I get an act. Um, Keith Stoddard Izzy was in um, a theater camp called Skyrise Theater, and they do um, uh, they do theater camps, they do theater classes. It was super cute. Um, so I'm reaching out to them, try to get them to come and do a medley of songs or an improv class or something for kids. Mm -hmm. And I suspect that the bigger stage would be good for them if we did that. We got to call back. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I can yeah, and then you can still use it. Tomorrow. You can still use it for the, uh, for the other stuff. For the yeah. or is it, I, just know, call I know the person who hired them, okay. so maybe an email from them. Or do something. Sure. Yeah, and you can still use it as a centerpiece for the dog races and all that stuff. Yeah. 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 How about the dog racing? Uh, How about the magician? Thank you. Uh, have we moved on to entertainment? Sounds like. Uh, I don't know. I thought Mary. Oh. You seem to say that their decisions. Okay. Well, what? I, made, what's What's the side about? What's the side about the yeah. ice cream guy? So Gary Vecchioni, yeah. Gary Vecchioni uh, only does novelties, so I have to call him back <laughs> and tell him that we're looking for someone that that does um, soft serve soft and Sundays and you know that type of stuff. Doesn't right? really kids, right? Mm -hmm. Okay, more full service ice cream. Sure. Yep. Doesn't need right. small children. All right. Um, um. That's that part. Uh, uh, is fully on board. Um, they are going to come in here in the morning, early in the morning, and set it up. Well, I'm just going through my stuff. They're not on the agenda. Sorry, maybe next week. Too. And then. Um, yeah, but they're not going to stay all they're day. They're not going to have what? a person stay all day like they did last time. Wait, what? Hmm? Why not? Because, because they have they have right. another event they're doing. <laughs> How late are they staying? They're going to come and set up and be gone. The, one of the benefits of using them was that someone was making sure those kegs were working. Yeah. Not Keith. They <laughs> not Keith. They <laughs> will. Um, what they did tell me was is that they would come. They would make sure that they were working. They would train our people, whoever we had, to do it, um, and, and keep them running. I'm nervous about this. It'll be fine. <laughs> I'm nervous about it. Okay. I'm I, I mean, I, ho I hope it is. I hope it is, right? And, and yeah, let's hope it's fine. Um, because A, we lose out on sales yeah. when the kegs are pouring foam. Mm -hmm. And yeah. it's not Keith's job. And he's difficult to track down in the day. You go and hide during the event if you, if I, you, no. Yeah, that's what I do. <laughs> is I just, I camp out and I wait for someone to give me a fried dough. Hey, I don't no fried dough either. for you unless you fix the kegs. <laughs> no, so there's never no. any fried dough no. for me. Make sure the kegs don't break. Yeah, we'll, we'll work on that. I'll you know what I'm saying? Like one of the yeah. benefits, one of the selling points of these I, guys was I, that they're going to have someone. I get it, but we didn't have that from Berkshire either. Okay. No, which is why we no longer are using yeah, BBC. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, so, but we'll, but we'll, we'll, do what we have to do to make sure it works. 
right. see if you could possibly talk them into sending someone. Yeah, we'll 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 figure it out. I'm I'm not concerned at this moment. Okay. Um, well, I will make sure that they work. The Nobody wants them to pull fast and me. There was also another idea. They made a recommendation, <coughs> in that we sell beer tickets so that the women that are pouring don't have to worry about because that caused a lot of congestion. Yeah, yeah that's a great idea. They they just couldn't handle the the water. So so we're gonna probably we're gonna consider that and figure we out. We should. That. Yeah. Let's talk about that. What would that look like? Hmm? So does that mean we need another yeah, person where? handling the cash and the tickets? You got the two bartenders, and we're losing a bouncer, um, so we have to find another bouncer. But um, so we have to find another person to do that. Yeah. Oh, okay. Yeah. Fortunately, I have two people that have volunteered there for that day. Um, Keith sent me this thing for somebody that wanted to volunteer. You forwarded that to me, and then um, I said, "Okay, <laughs> that's when this stuff comes up." Um, but I haven't reached out to them. Yet. I did reach out to you. Sent another one that somebody asked another question, and I responded. Anyway. So, where are you thinking of selling tickets? They're going to be somewhere in the beer garden. Yeah. Not, a, area. not at the bar, though. Not at the bar. Because that's congested. So. It won't be at the bar. Yeah. You know, big signage. Last thing you want is people mm -hmm. waiting in a poor line without a ticket, right? CD. Yeah. Line. Yeah. You need a big, some signage. Right? Mm -hmm. Get your tickets here, get your pours here. Yep. Yep. Now, I, uh, I'm thinking we can start up for discussion. Okay. But we could also maybe sell them at the ticket booth. I don't think you want to do that. You need to make sure people are. Why is that? Because they somebody can then them. give somebody else their ticket and, and just keep it controlled. They can do that in the beer garden. Like you're inviting yourself. You're inviting. Yeah, it, it, it's a good point, though. So yeah, they exactly. need to check the ID. If you're buying a ticket, you have to have an ID showing yeah. you're this yeah. of yeah. age. They would have done that. Because they would have done that at the ticket the booth. Butt, they would have carted them at the ticket booth if they, they were sold the ticket. It was just an idea, but um, but I can I can see problems, but you'd have those problems anyway. They could still buy a ticket and give it to somebody on age. Right? Yeah, it's just a little more of a controlled yeah. atmosphere. The, the, the advantage is, though, is that is if that did happen and they gave a ticket to somebody that was underage, okay, and then they go to present that ticket, uh, uh, my bar, the bartenders are smart enough to know that that can't happen. Yeah. Um, <laughs> and, and the beer can't leave the beer garden, so yeah. you know, it's not like they can buy it and walk out and hand it to an underage person either, so, so it's kind of a role. <coughs> Are we taking a harder line on on underage? Yes, that it's very yeah, vitally garden. important that I have seating outside the beer garden so, because that was the reason for them being in there last year. They bought food and they had no place to sit with their family and eat it, so they used the beer garden. So I got kids in there. Mm -hmm. okay? um, they weren't drinking. We were watching that. The kids weren't drinking, but but they shouldn't be in there. Okay. Invite, and and the way to keep them out of there is to put seating someplace else. Okay, so that's now now what happens is is that you know they they, don't, they the bouncer ha can say look there's seating over there for you and your family that young youngsters can't come in the. But basement. I want to drink my beer. Huh? There are going to be people that have younger children that they want to have their glass of wine and beer. And the With kids the are really too young to sit over there at the table, so <coughs> those will be going in. But there'll be less people there, going. It'll be, it'll it'll reduce the problem. Okay. We have to. We're we're, yeah. we're asking for problems. Yeah. But yeah. That's fine. That, I've always wanted it that way. No children in the beer garden. Yeah. Well, I don't think Tony's saying no children in the beer garden. Hmm? You're not saying no children in the beer garden. No. You're, just, be you're less just trying to uh, give look, them an alternative. So I'm giving them an alternative so that they don't have an excuse, and I don't have a bouncer that has to sit there and say no to a woman that wants to bring her eight-year-old kid in there, so that she can have, you know, so that he can sit down and eat his meal, when he can. Ha he, there's a chair over there. See? Okay. So. Okay. 
<laughs> so is the eight-year-old going to be allowed in or no? No. Okay. Yeah. So you are saying no children in the beer yeah. garden. Yeah. Okay. Nobody under 21 in the beer garden? That's correct. Yeah. It's the right thing to do. Might not be the, yeah. might not be the easy thing to do, but it's the right thing to do. Uh -huh. But now what happens is, is they can't, you know, they, they, they can't hit him with what they consider a logical reason, you know, for having the eight-year-old sit down to be able to eat his dent his lunch, you know. Um, because they, have, I just, they I have an alternate. Yeah. I, just now the issue is going to be like, well, but I want to sit with my family and have my beer. Well, you can't. So. Yeah. 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 Uh, if you have kids, you also know that that's, what, that's how that goes. Now, we, we have lost one of our bouncers. Do you have someone else in mind, or are we in search for another bouncer? I have, I have somebody else okay. in mind. I think I, All think, right. I think I can talk Peter here when he's doing it. I don't think so. Yeah, well, he's already said he'd consider it. Okay, I'm saying. That's a soft yes. Hmm? That's a soft yes. That's a soft yes, yeah. And That's if he doesn't, great. I'll get somebody else. Okay, next. Entertainment. Uh, let's see. John cake. wants to talk about his entertainment. Oh, uh, well, uh, the cake is all set. Oh, wow, um, good. I, I yeah. sent off a deposit. We signed a, I, I created a special appearance contract for them uh, because they're actually going to be part of entertainment for a while, setting up the cake. So, how <laughs> about, um, yeah. about speakers? Have you, have you reached out on that yet? What, what was that? Speakers. Speakers for, for the, the birthday thing. Yeah, I've guests. asked the selectman to take care of that for me. Okay. Okay. Um, and just to make mm -hmm. sure it happens. Okay. I got another because I had uh, Kevin involved, um, but just to make sure it happens, Michael Fitzpatrick said that he would assist that effort. Okay. Um, so we got going to have an invitation go out to McKenna, one to Fat Man. We'll have some selectmen there, and we're gonna also going to invite the governor and the lieutenant governor. Hopefully, we get one of them. Okay. If we do, and we get news of that, it's going to change our event a little. Okay. Because now, now we have a draw for the media. So you know, we're going to invite Channel Five or Channel Seven, <laughs> something like that. It's a big deal for the town. It's 275 years old, so it's a milestone. So it should get some kind of recognition, you know? and it won't hurt our event either. Maybe we should be, maybe we should be plugging the news outlets anyway. Yes, we should be, absolutely. It is, a, yeah, it is a big deal. How do we, how do we go about doing that? Keep a red press release, guys. Keep a red press release, <laughs> and then I'll make it sound good. I, I think we'd have to advertise that John was going to get shot that day. I think, I think that. So what? I, a paid ad? Telegram Gazette won't give us a spot. Oh no! Yeah, like, but if you're talking like video channels, like mm -hmm. you know, Channel Five and that kind of stuff, like we pretty much have to guarantee that somebody's going to bleed. We've had a lot of. I've, I've, I've had a lot of introductions of like. Hey, this is a really good event. They're like, yeah, if we can get out there, we will. And then, well, it doesn't hurt anyway. So. You could do some, like even the free newspapers and stuff that come in the mail. Oh, no, you could do a big, huge. You just had an article, but why can't they interview you guys? They will. They, they always do. They yeah, do. Okay. They do. We're talking new uh, TV. Yeah. Oh. He wants. He oh. wants Austin wants wants channels. Yeah. He wants channel five there. Okay, I'm gonna put Keith and John in doing a press release and looking into TV. Mm -hmm. Let's get Chronicle. Mm -hmm. I mean, we pretty much know that we're we'll friends. You want to? You want? Yeah. Okay. Someone's phone is vibrating. So, yes. Michael Fitzpatrick is calling. Okay. Well, that could be Governor Baker said yes. Or maybe Michelle Obama should probably do, answer. Do we want to take his call? Yeah. Tell him he's on, he, yeah. we're in a meeting, he's on speaker. Oh, did you say that? He did. I don't know, I, I walked in somehow. 
If he calls for the third time, it'll be. He's going to be like, Michelle Obama can be there, but you have to answer right now, and you just totally messed up. Hey, how you doing, Tony? Hey, Mike. I'm you're on your speakerphone. Hey, right you're, now. You're in your meeting? Yep. yep. And you're on speaker. You're, you're on, on camera. In camera. Yeah. No big deal. So I reached out to a friend of mine that's gonna uh, that has a connection with McGovern uh, office. So he's gonna she's gonna reach out to them tomorrow. Get us that contact, and I'll reach out to the uh, McKenna and uh, Fatman's office tomorrow. Awesome. Let's see what we can do with that. That would be awesome. Yeah, I just don't want to duplicate our efforts, so that's why I'm just telling you what I'm doing. So that yep. way. Uh, if somebody's else is already working on it, then okay, don't wanna good be pestering people. Yeah, so we'll wait. But that's from what your understanding is, nobody else is working on that as of yet, right? That's right. All right. All right. So I'm gonna run with it. I'll see what I can do, and I'll keep you up to date. Thank you. All right. Anything else I can do for you guys? Let me know. Money. Get me money. What are you trying to raise? Now I'm teasing. <laughs> <laughs> A lot. Right. Whatever. <laughs> All right, take it, take it easy. All right, all right. Bye. Okay, so that? was easy. Uh, oh, that was funny. Anyway, uh, so, working. Great, all right. So that yeah. leads me into asking John Statuley. I got it. I got it, you didn't. I got a different one. Got you got it. a statue person? Yep. Okay, we might as well sl snake into entertainment now, because that's the statue person. You got someone? Oh. No, you don't have the statue lady. Oh, I have a different statue lady. Yes. Yeah. Just, yeah. I have one. Okay, yeah, so you okay. have a statue lady. So what's, what's the deal on this statue lady? Um, she's all day. She's there. She's three. <coughs> she stands there. She moves to deep tipper. <laughs> um, <laughs> The other one did like 300 tips or something. Yeah, Probably. she's I think the same. Those hurt. That's not why my head hurts. Uh, 150 for the day. One, 150? Yes. Wow. For the That's day? A good and day. then she does tips, right? Yep. Good, she can come for two days. 150, well, the, the, on day two there will be an event, <laughs> so she looked really out of place downtown. Okay. Um, 150 for the day, and, uh, and she works for tips. Nice. Uh, you know, she's her own. She's a little bit different than the other one, but yeah, she, yeah, you know, whatever. Same, something, something. same, same deal. Um, so she's confirmed. Get her a contract. Um, I reached out to. Do we have a contract for this year yet? Huh? Do we have this year's contract? We just changed the, just changed the date. We changed the dates. Um. I. <laughs> I don't believe that there is a date on. There is so yeah, dates and times. Yeah, yeah. but they yeah. but you fill them in. Yeah, yeah. There's it, yeah. All right. So get, the entertainment contract saying. is blank. Yeah, right. yeah and okay. you fill it in. Yeah, I get it. Um, I, don't I thought there was actually like a no, it was not. It, yeah, not yeah, yeah. Right. Okay, so reached out to Ed the Wizard who performed two years ago. At our event, and I want to say we had him for a half day mm -hmm. or a couple hours. Mm -hmm. He did a stage performance, 30, 45 minutes, and then he walked around the event and did street magic and balloon animals for like a couple hours. Um, I want to have him the whole day this year because he was hugely popular as he was walking around, and I think it's great. It's like a great yeah. thing. For the yeah, event. it's a great thing. Yeah. He's 650 for the day. I like it. And he'll do whatever we want. It's a whole day. Really help load stages. <laughs> <laughs> With magic, you can do it faster. Now, make this stage disappear. That's, yeah. But that's one. So he does like, he's going to do a stage show, and then he's yeah. going to be like wandering around. Can we get Can we get him to do a state, uh, another show up at the other stage? He'll do whatever you want. He's yeah. ours for the day. Right? right. So if you say, I want two 45-minute shows, we'll yeah. do it. If you want yeah. Whatever you want. Can he make the statue person disappear? <laughs> How cool would that be? You want two performances? I want two stage performances, one on each one of the stages. Okay. Right? 
and then have him wander around. <laughs> and so room. I don't think. Watch me make this beer disappear. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. No kidding. I don't think we'll have enough time in the schedule for a full 45 minute show on the okay. main stage. Yeah. But certainly probably for. Uh, no, 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 no. I wasn't talking about the main stage. Yeah. I was oh. talking about. The Two side stages. The goodness store stage and then the other stage. Stage C? Barbecue stage. The barbecue stage? Yeah, no. No. But there's an ice cream truck. I don't think he'll pull a crowd. <coughs> I you think, you'll, you I think he'll gather a crowd, even if not pull a crowd. Let, what, you know, I let, could be wrong. But look at the schedule and see. It, it may or may not make sense. It, it, well, but but also though we can we can move things around so that you get some activity up there, so that may we'll get him seen. Don't forget now, I got two trains. One of them specifically a kid train that goes yeah. up there, right? Um, and then we're gonna have ice cream up there. Right. Okay, all right. So and there will be seating up there for people with ice cream. Ice cream and seating and, and train and that's kids. That's that's magic. Okay. <laughs> well, that's the magician. That's his audience. Couldn't he right? do the Pied yeah. Piper thing yeah. all the way up Depot Street and then get on the stage and perform? I mean, if he's if he's smart, he's saying all day, "Hey, I'm performing at at two o'clock. Stick around, come see me at two o'clock." As he's doing the street magic, if he's smart, he's selling himself. He's advertising okay. himself. What time are we doing? Yeah, that? come see me at come three, see me at two o'clock. At, at two o'clock up there, you know. Yeah. Um, yeah, maybe. My, ne my next show's at. Yep. What time are we doing the cake? Because uh, that just reminded three me. Three o'clock. Three. 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 All right. Um, now. Uh, yeah. Uh, well, yes. just, let's let's just run that again. Oh, I'm sorry. I took if we. John. We, what happens if we get someone like the governor or or the lieutenant governor, and, and they're going to change the time? Okay, who is going to change the time? Well, if, if they if if the governor says I can be there, but I can only be there at noon, I have to leave after noon. We'll then we'll deal with that problem when it comes. Yeah, I'm just saying that yeah. it has a potential of that happening, mm -hmm. right? Yeah, I get it. You might have to modify schedule. The, yes. the problem is, I mean, we, you know, we, we advertise a schedule, and at some point, it, it'll be you know, well, harder to. Yeah, do hopefully we'll Let's know. cross that bridge if it happens. Yeah. yeah. Um, I went down to Grill on Main to check with those. Mm -hmm. Good. Down there. They reached out to you, correct? Yeah. They did reach out to you. Well, only with only with a question. Is, you know, how do they, they, they were interested in putting up a tent, I think it said. The, the email actually said text, but I think they meant tent, yeah. okay? So they were interested in putting up a tent, in, you know, in, in, their, in their lot. Yes. Now, I don't know what that means. What, it, what does it mean? That I thought they wanted to sell merchandise. Like, uh, well, see, that's, that, that's okay. Well, right? hold, so I spoke to someone down there. Yeah. She... I asked her about the, the truck, right? That's mm -hmm. the question using right. the lot for the truck. Right. And she's there under new ownership or management, I don't know. Ownership. Ownership. Yep. Okay. And so she was, she was one of the owners. Um, she did not give approval to use the spot because, uh, well, she didn't deny it either, she, but she approved it or deny it. In the past, they've been frustrated about the spots in front of the restaurant being blocked um, and they wanted to do something in their parking lot or something. So that's when I gave her your contact info. Mm -hmm. And I said, we've got a meeting. She's like, I'm getting married. <laughs> I said, Congratulations. Um, but email Tony and um, anything that they want to do, she should bring before the committee. Yeah, I haven't heard that they, uh, I did send her an email saying something very, very similar. Yeah. Like, Great. What do you, you know, you can download a form and pull out a form, you know, please let us know what you want to do, you know, um, and then we'll take it from there. But that was it. I haven't heard anything. So that's where, that's where we're at with that. No. It's going to depend on whatever they want to do is what yeah. we decide. If they, it, if they want to do merchandise, 
Okay, and then you know what? What do they tell them? That's what pretty much we do across the board with every other vendor. We had, they tell us what they're going to do. You had mentioned to them in the email that there were vendor forms for them to yeah. fill out or whatever, and yeah. we haven't heard back. But I just saw on Facebook that said they have just returned from vacation. Yeah. Right. So yeah. I'm so thinking that's why we haven't heard back from yeah. them yet. Okay. So I can I can try because I think she reached out to me on Facebook or something like that. So I can okay. they can try and ping them. Yeah. And yeah. See. But they really do have to kind of let us know what mm -hmm. they plan on doing so we yep. can kind of work it in. So we don't yet have approval yeah. to use the lot for the... Um, yeah. yeah. We, There's fortunately, only so many places okay. we can put them, so... Mm -hmm. right. we, do, we do have an alternate that we can put them. But. We can try that, but we need to... I, I kind of like an answer so I can know what I'm doing. Um, I get that. It'd, it'd be nice to have them as a cooperative actor again. And we... We have left a couple vendor spaces open so people can come in and out of their driveway. Yeah, we, we leave the driveway open. We don't leave yeah. the whole complete driveway open, but you know most of it is open. It's not. It, we we don't. Because it's like four vendor sites. Yeah. We don't restrict people from going in there. Okay. So there's nothing blocking people from going in there. There are things blocking people from driving in there, but the street is closed anyway. Yeah. So, you know. But we, yeah, we need to know what they want to do. Yep. Yeah. Like I said, it just, you know, the, the I, I felt like the, the event was, was better when they were involved. Reach out to them. Yeah. So, like I said, I'm, I'm, I mean, you remember, like, they have the t-shirts and, like, they were just, like, super into it. It was, mm -hmm. it was awesome. I liked that. Yeah, mm -hmm. nice if we were able to harness that enthusiasm again. I've reached out to a couple Oompa bands. I got a call back today, but they've got a gig in New Haven at two. Yeah. So she was trying to make it, you know, she's like, how, how yeah, long is the drive from? 6.30, there won't be anyone there, but. She's like, we could perform when we come back, and I'll be quiet, but I'm gonna be there. Um, make it hit by a car. So that's the one Oompa band. The other one hasn't gotten back to me yet. Um, but, you know, it's like Oktoberfest season, and so yep. we might not get one. Um, they're also expensive. I think she was, I asked what her rate was anyway, and it was like going to be 900 bucks for three hours. <laughs> for five or six piece or whatever it is. Yeah. It sounds perfect. Um, also reached out to a juggler, a juggling act, who has been on um, America's Got Talent, Ellen, James Corden, but he's got another kid that day. And, 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 yeah. yeah, but someone told me that John juggles. Yeah. No, this guy's like... <laughs> I give you a chainsaw. This guy is good. He's funny. He's good. He's funny. Uh, anyway, I asked what his rate was, and he was fifteen hundred plus travel. But he said, "Talk to me because sometimes I have frequent flyer miles that I can use." Um, I want to say he might live in California, but I know you. I know that like scratches an itch for you because I know you'd love to be able to say that we've got someone who has also done all these big names. So, something to keep in mind maybe for next year. I don't know how how much huh? fifteen hundred. Uh, well, you guys are gonna have to start going after your own sponsors because you guys are going after expensive <laughs> people. <laughs> but you can't go after the sponsors, huh? Stop. Stop with the pen, please. It's annoying. Thank you. Really? If he could kick you under the table, he would. How long are your legs? <laughs> Am okay. I wrong? Am I wrong? You would love that, wouldn't you? What? You would love someone who's also been on the night, the late night shows and America's Got Talent. No, no, no. <laughs> what? For years you've been no, grilling I us somebody, on that. I asked for, I asked wanted for, like 38 I asked specials. for bands of names I recognize. No. That's they're all want. dead. <laughs> <laughs> Actually, they're not. They're all playing in hey, Indian Ranch. Right. Yeah. Right. Yeah. We're going to go yeah. see Foreigner. They, they all play in Indian Ranch. Just died. It doesn't matter how loud or quiet you play the show because they're all deaf anyway. <laughs> <laughs> what? What? Is that the who? Now. It's the Rolling Stones. Did you tune? <laughs> I 
We had somebody ask for the point and swing band to come back. <clears throat> Was that the point and swing band? I'm sorry, I could not resist that. I still think we need to, my opinion. And, I, and I'm sure they're great. I am sure they're great. They're just, I just feel like they're pricey for what they are. That's all. Um, I think we need to go after the cultural council and get some free entertainment from them too. I mean, certain other ones in town are getting all of it. And I'm like, hey, we could use some of that to help the Oktoberfest. Um, We're not going for it, no. Every year we put money aside, which which is which is which was very much by design. When when I when I joined the committee, you remember I was like, no, we need to put X amount of money aside every year, and we have a nice little nest egg. And if occasionally we dip into the nest egg, put on an extra special event, then so be it. Because the whole point was to not have what happened to the fireworks. So if we had a wipeout year that totally crushed us, we'd still have money to go back into the till, and we have that plus. So. We're okay. We're okay, Ma. We're going to be able to eat this week. Right? Yes, we can afford a juggler. <laughs> a 15 hour old juggler. We spent on America's Got Talent. Uh, yeah, but he wants, he wants to travel when he lives in California. Yeah, he's yeah, double booked, yeah, right? Yeah. So for next year. <laughs> $99, $99 on Frontier. Does he want room and board, too? Yeah, he can, can stay at Kiso. He has room stay upstairs. He <laughs> <laughs> stay at Kiso. Uh, I think that's about all I got for entertainment. That's we it. have a schedule. Keith and I have a, a draft of a schedule. You do? Yes. Yeah. Awesome. Do. So can I stop putting together the program? No. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> we, we said no. <laughs> we, have, we have times. We don't have like all It's very rough. Filled. And it all depends. Yeah. Mean, because well, Michelle Obama could wind right. up speaking and then we're going to have to move everything around. If we happen to get the programs out early, people will be so we're excited not, we're we're put them, to put them out. We're not going to do that. Yeah, you can only have the program two days before the event. That's just the way it works. And, and at this point, just not put it online. The, you know, the last meeting before the event was sitting here folding programs. Yeah. We, yeah. most we, of us, are we, folding programs. Yeah. Yeah. Most of us. I said we. Well, like we, are folding programs. Who else is there? You. Oh, I'm absent oh. that meeting. Yeah. Oh, you didn't. Meet, you meant not him. Yeah. yeah. He yeah. doesn't fold any programs. No, that's not true. He folds fold fold them so fold slow. Three you just don't he, like he, the way. Hey, look, he folds them three or four at a time and quits after four. That's untrue. <laughs> I feel like I'm, I'm. My good name is being all right. Tarnished. Mal yeah. It would be. It would be good. You know, especially seeing as how you know we do want to build some excitement on this. It would be good if we had a program. Um, or link from around. Give me other updates for entertainment. We talk about uh, the band, the marching band, the non-marching band. <laughs> <laughs> They're going to be a stationary band this year. Is it going to be a what? They're going to be a stationary band this year, which works. Which it works fine. That's that's, fine. that's what we. That's what it kind of halfly what John and I had talked about is we're just we're going to have them, you know, just perform at the stage like the choir. Um, you know, around the, tick, around the cake. So. Wait, wait, wait. Is this the high school band? Yeah. Oh, let's discuss that. I did. Um. I have a thought on that. They're, they're Everyone knows sure that the end of the event is the high school marching band. And so if you have that in the middle of the day, they'll be like, what's happening? It's what? over? What? What? Where, where, what? Are you even in the same meeting? They're going to be at the end of the day. They're just not marching. They're, s they're a stationary band. They don't have the numbers that they had in previous years due to COVID. COVID. I don't care if it's only four. It's why are they part not, of the why are they not marching? fund. What? Is anybody listening? Am I, I, I'm asking. <laughs> Why are they not marching? They don't have the numbers from, from uh, their numbers are low. And I think because so of that, look right. COVID, it would just be weird. And something about training or something. Yeah. If there's like, like 10 people marching down the street, that will just look weird. Whereas if you, if you have like depressing, you know, 10 people playing in front of the cake. So they're going to play. Okay, but they're still going to do it. They're going to play, but stationary. Yeah. yeah. Not in marching. But at 4 o'clock. I uh, made it at three thirty, I think. Is it? Or, well, yeah, somewhere around that. At, at the end of the day, yeah. like towards the end of the day. Yeah, because um, they are the ending to the event, and yeah. I'm gonna stick with that. Yeah. They are the ending the, the, to good, the event. Good, good for you. We just don't know if they're going to. <laughs> <laughs> the, um, so, if you want to grab and, a tuba, and sensations is working up a a um, a dance type parade that's going to happen. At three o'clock. 
When were you planning on telling them? Yeah, what? Us? What? I, what? I, I did mention it last time. No, you did not. Time. Yes, I did. Is that in the minutes, John? He did mention something about it. Yeah. But I <laughs> <don't remember exactly. laughs> You're busted. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, for, for, we have the marching, the non-marching band is at the end of the day. Yeah. yeah. And then, um, and that's part of the cake thing. Yeah. Dance well, sensations. The, the cake. Yeah. Oh, dance sensations. Oh, you did mention that. All right. Yeah, there oh, the I cake. have it here in the notes. Yeah. Send off dance sensations. Okay. Marching to celebration. Yeah. yeah. So. You can't come up with something other than. Well, if you're gonna come up with doing? another song, you gotta be awfully quick, and you guys are the ones that are gonna deliver it to because dun, they've been practicing. Dun, dun. They've been practicing. Dun, 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 dun. I love that song. <laughs> we have. Are they marching up Main Street? Yeah. Oh, they are have. Songs and if she's gonna have her wrong. dances dressed no, as um, uh, princesses, like you know Disney princesses and, and fairies, and fairies and, and okay, okay, yeah. Um, we need. <laughs> so that means we still need to run the FM system. Yes. And we need better radios. Well, they're going to pull a radio, which will be good, on, on a little... No, we need better... You had those little FM transmitters? Okay. We need yeah. better ones. Okay. Right. Because they're not powerful enough. Okay. Oh, we just need to juice up the signal. And no, I don't think it. FCC to come. No, we're cranked. The gain's cranked on them. I don't think they're powerful enough. Amplification and signal. Oh, you don't think they put out enough wattage? Okay. What? Okay. So what wattage do we need? <laughs> Just bigger, bigger, bigger. I don't know what. <laughs> this is all like flying by the seat of our pants. So. So the receivers, not the transmitter. The receivers. transmitter. Yeah, transmitter. Transmitter is fine. Yeah. 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 Transmitter is okay. easy. So you need FM receivers. FM receivers. Radios. And you need three of them. We need one. We need two. Two. Well, right. one, one for stage B, one for stage One for stage C. C. And we have... And, Do and we need? No, we had a speaker. We had, we, and, and Bear had a set of speakers that he brought halfway. And that actually worked okay. So three. Huh? Three. Did you get Bear this year? Did you get better this year? You did? All right. Yeah. It's a very... What? What? <laughs> That's a very soft yes. What? You got there? Is that a yes? Yeah. yeah. You didn't ask him? I just asked you if you asked him. Oh, uh, no. I did asked you? him I asked him about speaking. I said, did you get him? Yeah. And he I said yes. All right, let me do okay. this. Has anyone contacted Bear for the sound for this year at Oktoberfest? Uh, yeah, I did. Isn't he part of entertainment? <laughs> You're killing me here, Keith. You did? You did. Yeah, no, we're all safe. Yeah. We funny. got Bear. Then what are you asking me if I did? We <laughs> they wanted to catch you on. <laughs> I don't know. I don't know. <laughs> I'm bored. What can I say? Moving um, on. Yeah. However, we, okay. Just remind him then the next time you speak to him that he has to bring extra the, the satellite speakers for the middle of the street. All right. Okay. He yeah, brought them last time. Remind me that I'm, I'm not going to remember. Okay. I'll send you an email. That would be good. I like emails. Um, would you like to that's you do have no, paper really and notes too. But that's right. We live in a different technology world. That's right. We don't use paper. Yeah, we don't. I don't. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Way to bring that back around, Tony. Nice work on that. Next. Uh, yes, we lost David. our photographer. Oh, no. Um, I saw that email or Facebook or whatever that went out for looking for a yeah. volunteer photographer. Uh, Chris Billard is going to step up the door. Oh, yes. So, yeah, he's got, like, the drone and all that stuff. So. That's good. Yeah. So, he stepped up right away. Set up your guy. So, great. Thanks. He takes great pictures. That's awesome. I talked to Webster first. Yeah. How'd that go? Good. Good game. Great. As long as 
They, they say that that day they don't have many drive throughs anyway, probably three or four, maybe, until noon, maybe, okay? Um, because they know that, you know, the customers come in the back door. So uh, they don't have a problem in, in us using the, the full length as long as we don't block the front stairs. That's awesome. Okay. Did you uh, talk to the police? And are, are you going to? I'm going to, yes. Okay. About that? Our, yes. Our I just wanted to make right sure that it was okay with what was the first for us. You know, uh, Will they provide some some conage? Or do we I get any? enough cones anyway from the highway department, so I'll make sure we have that covered. I'll tell the police there may be three or four cars coming out that direction. They're used to that anyway when people set up. It's just going to go a little longer. Do we even need Do we even need to put cones there if it's only three or four cars? Yeah, we got to. We got to. Yeah, it only takes one car to kill a child. Yeah, I'm sure. the odds. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah. yeah. We're gonna, we're, we'll we'll fix it so that it looks safe. That's what looks safe. <laughs> Not <laughs> is safe. <laughs> looks safe. <laughs> There's a government job out there for you somewhere. <laughs> I, got some, <laughs> I got some sidewalk chalk. We can just use yeah, it. It doesn't have to be safe. It just needs to look safe. <laughs> Get some chalk. This is safe. Go right. <laughs> <laughs> all right. So they're good. That's all. They're good. good. They're good. We got to get someone to run. We're gonna have to. Yeah, run that. We're definitely gonna have to reach out and look for volunteers any way that we can because we have a lot of stuff that we have to run this time. Keith's doing uh, really well on volunteers. I give that to Keith. You're doing a great job. You love people. That's what I'm saying. You're doing a great job. You're a great, I used to love people. You're a great communicator. I was, I was once like you. Yeah. An idealist. So we're going to need to um, we need to do a um, volunteer campaign, try to see if we can get some more volunteers. I think we also need a list of where we need the volunteers. So That. Don't we have and you keep saying that. I I have them. And then I, give and it to me, and I will put it up online and say this is what we need. Phil, oh, you want it digital? <laughs> it's up here. And, I, and then I'll say if you want to volunteer, please send a self-addressed stamped envelope to. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah, we need their contact information too, because we always have to verify that they are definitely coming. Okay then. Moving on. <laughs> we need someone to make chili. If you guys know anyone, we need more of a variation I, of food. Yeah, I'll make chili. Nobody will eat it. Has can, I, can, I not, can I not fold envelopes or show up the day of the event if I do? You want to give up your MC? John will find somebody. But you have to stay on the, you have to stay on the committee. No, that's. I I'm just, gonna find just someone. How did chili. I get roped into this? I have to find someone out to be. Because he chili. wants to make chili and sell, yeah. ch and he has to sell the chili for the day, just oh, like a less, regular vendor. That's will, less work for me. I will lose so much money. He wanted. He, he volunteered a minute ago to be the bouncer. Yeah. Okay. He doesn't know what he wants to be when he grows up. Wait till he sees the new train. He's gonna want to be the engineer. That I always. That is all I ever <laughs> wanted to do. That is all I wanted to do was drive the stupid. The train. new train's coming along nicely. He's spending a lot of time putting that baby together. Just want to drive the train. You're gonna be impressed when you see this. Okay, train. but I'm already we impressed, Tony. You, it doesn't take much for you to impress me. <laughs> right, so it doesn't take much for John to be impressed. All right, we Can I get, does and, somebody and, want to take a and stab the, and, and all the cars a have a steering wheel in it, so your kid will never get out of it. Um, so my kid get free tickets? Okay, why not? Wait, what? I I asked for the golden ticket for my kids to get them out of my hair for years. Uh, yeah, but you're a different person. Okay. Mm -hmm. you can, can, your kid's old enough to be you know, Can somebody you make me Wait. a flyer for the rib-off? Make you a flyer? You don't want to make a flyer? Yeah, I want a flyer for the rib-off. We don't have any uh, entries for that yet, do we? We don't have the flyer out. We don't have any of the, the oh, vendor form. Yeah, yeah he's got the rules out. Yeah. He's, he's got, got the rules. rules. And the rules, part of the the rules and the form are on the website. Yeah, right? yeah. yeah. It's, it's all there. Okay, that's all I need. I don't have... All right, send it to me again, so I'll put it on my desktop. And if people contact me, I just drop it in. Do we have the entrance from last year that we can reach out to? Two years ago? Yeah. Are we still in entertainment? Ribbon. Right. Ribbon. Ribbon. No. I will no forward entrance. the application with rules to last year's ribbon people. Yes, please. Okay. Two years. Yeah. Last year didn't. 
Next, soda concession. Yes. Save the best for last. No, we're not it's done not with everything else. It's not last. the last. That's like in the middle. Yes. In the middle. Okay. Do you want to wait? No. We're going, there's an agenda, and we're going in order. I move that we take the agenda out of order. You move to what? That we take the agenda out of order. No. Is there a second? No, so no <laughs> I, I, I tried to help you, Tony. You wanted the best for last. So now it's going to be Are you done with ribs? anticlimactic. I guess. Nobody Soda. wants to make me a flyer. Soda. Yes. I'll have Tony make you a flyer. Thank Speak. Um, so it was very really interesting. We kind of had the, like this email thing going back and forth where we, we said, oh, wow, this is cool, this is cool. Yeah, what buy all this do? crap. Yeah. Um, and then you were going to buy the crap. Yeah. So did you buy the crap? Do we want to buy the crap? Buy the crap. Okay, I didn't know that. I knew we had to, um, uh, you know, like, officially. Uh, like buy the crap, Tony. Now, he's rolling uh, his eyes. Um, do we don't want to buy the crap? No, it's just, um, just yeah, yeah, it just got really hard. Everything just got hard. That's hard? Yeah, because now you got to build a bar. Yeah, you got to build mm. a yeah, bar. Yeah, that means you have to build a bar. Look, I'm building. I'm building, building freaking stages. Yeah, he's building a train. And he's <laughs> building a train. <laughs> and you're whining something about that probably bar. would work better than what the T has. <laughs> and you're all like, "I'm gonna build a bar." <laughs> it's so hot. It's gonna be like four four, four by fours. Pocket screws, Jim. Yeah. Pocket screws. <laughs> this pocket screws for this. It doesn't have to be how fancy you do your Yeah, work. it doesn't have to have like it doesn't have to be. It is literally a box. <laughs> that is that is that is, Jay Menard Woodworking is I build box. Yeah. This is a box. It'll be a box. Build a yeah. box. Yeah. Build a box. Well, I want to make it look like soda jerky. You right? shouldn't do that though. You should make it soda jerky. That's what I'm trying. Okay. Soda jerky. Yeah, it's where you yeah. dehydrate soda. Yeah. <laughs> you just give, you just give kids bags of sugar. <laughs> so there you go. Are we, we going having a, are they scientists? We'll have you them in lab coats and they would know. No, kind of they're soda truck. jerks. Oh, you don't have a truck. No. You okay. don't know what a soda jerk is? Actually, believe it or not, okay, I'm I don't have a problem in helping you. Uh, um, because I also use that to go get supplies and stuff for the Boy Scout and all that. So we can combine the trips or something. We need the... We need the good squirty squirties. Yeah. Don't, don't All right. So, so what will happen is, is I'll go through those past emails and pick out that stuff, yeah. and then I'll send it to you guys to look at. Yeah. Right. And okay. then you know, just you give a, a yes, this one or this one. All right. Um, so I'll, I'll go through it in detail, with John. Yeah. <coughs> I'm rescinding my involvement from anything that has to do with. Uh, I don't care. Just get whatever you want. Squirty squirties. I want, I want the good squirties. Get it. You have approved to get the. <laughs> you have been blessed. Squirty squirties. <laughs> okay, so so go through go through the thing. You have it. You, ha I, you want I me do. to go through it again? No, 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 no. no right, I'll, 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 you just I said you were going to go through it again. I, I was saying I'll pick through the emails. Okay. I'll come up with a list of the whole stuff yeah. and before I'll I purchase anything. I'll send it off to you to make sure that I didn't miss anything. Right? Yep. Uh, okay. Uh, and then and then we'll order the stuff in the other and then you, okay, and me have to hook up so that we can go and um, get, some get some materials. Yeah. yeah. Um, do you have a vision of what you want this thing to look like? Just no, go can. on Pinterest in soda jerk. Really? I'd be interested to see what it looks like. I mean, like, do you want like, do you want it to look similar in size and scope to the? It has to have the beer bar. Yeah. Yeah. That's really big. Yeah. Does it have to be that big? Really? Mm -hmm. How many people are you gonna have man? Two? One, two, two? I, I it, probably two. And I'm I'm maybe three, because I'm kinda thinking the same thing where it's like I mean you, you to you have to have a you. third person dealing with the money, you know yep. what I mean? So money person, yep. squirty squirty person. Soda person, you know what I mean. So, oh, what's worth? You know, what flavors do you want? Squirt, squirt. Yeah, because it over to this guy, you know. This is going to be a little different than you know, like uh, you know, like Wild Bills because Wild Bills they just give them a cup and let them go do their own. Yeah, they they can't do that. Right, they have, have to be served. Yeah, we got to get it. We need an outfit. Yes, 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 yes. yes. We need the soda jerk outfit. Absolutely. 
Oh, I like the little bow ties. I was just thinking a lab coat. I, I think I think for this for somebody that didn't care five minutes ago. Now I care. Somebody cares. I think we should pay someone to run this. The booth. What's come up with the booth? I, I, I disagree. I, I I think you can get two or people. work for like, tips. Yes. Work for yeah, tips. Like I said, I, I'm trying to talk Liam into doing it. I'm like, oh, you, make you make a killing work for tips at that point. Oh, yeah. That. Yeah. So I, I, split it up. That's with a few if he wants to give day. up hanging out with his yeah. friends downtown. He's at that age, you know. Yeah. I think that they'll make a ton, ton of money on tips. Yep. <clears throat> That's just like they do in the beer garden. They make a ton on tips there. Yep. They, they do well. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. So it is done. Okay. Right. And that's got to go down near the goodness store area. Yes, which okay. I'm still working on getting approval from. That's my guess. From Rhoda? Mm -hmm. Is she okay? The antique cars guess. there? Hmm? I have some ideas. It. Oh, she's not happy. Tile no, theme. No, I don't know. Yeah. So get her on the phone. White, red, and black, yeah. kind of. She was yeah. just white, red, retro, black, and white, retro, you know, retro. newspaper for something. Yeah, you want to make you want to make it retro. Yeah. I'll look. I'll look up for a few I'll designs. I'll bounce them off. Yeah. Something. Yeah. I'm okay with lab coats. I'm just saying, lab coats are an apron. Mm -hmm. It's not a science experiment, Mary. Oh, okay. Keep it on point. Okay. Okay. All right. This is serious yeah. business. Back to the future theme, you know? There you go. All right, moving on. Prizes. Oh, yeah, yeah, okay, that's, we have a whole bunch <laughs> of... He <laughs> <You> liked that. <laughs> no, I don't think that, I don't, what? I don't think that, that was a soda jerk. What? what? Back to the Future. Back to the Future, I think Back to the Future was just soda fountain. No, it was a soda, it was a soda jerk. Yeah. Where he ordered the Pepsi free from? Because it, 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 he made a phosphate in the background. Oh, really? Yeah. Oh, all right. Not yeah. the future version of that. Yeah, yeah, no, I just, I, I kind of thought, like, soda jerks were a little... And he goes, for uh, no, if you want a Pepsi stuff. free, you're going to pay for it. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <Huh>. <laughs> Prizes. Prizes. We have a large donation <coughs> from the Douglas Animal Hospital. She has given us many boxes of prizes that we'll let Melissa put together however she wants to. Some can go separate, some will be grouped. Um, I picked up, Tony has receipts there. Yo, Tony, there's a receipt for, I had a store that had starting school supplies. Anyway, I'm trying to find that. It's only twenty six dollars. Jeez, Mary. I know. To bankrupt this. I know. This isn't a juggler. What do you want me to sign in blood? Thank you. <laughs> it would mean so much more if you put your blood hand cock on there. I could frame it and save it forever. But anyway, so we also have about eight stuffies. Some of them are really big. A gecko. A stuffy. You have a gecko? We have two gecko stuffies. We have. Is that like a furry? A whole bunch of them. It is not like a furry. <laughs> no, we're not. We're not yet. Don't, okay. be, don't make this weird. Okay. Prizes are all are forward, going forward. That's all I have to say with these guys. Don't make it weird, John. <laughs> well, we you're make it weird. When <laughs> Too late. It's already on film. Yeah. You're making it weird. And we're, I have tried contacting Melissa. I did hear from her. Um, her family was in an accident oh, no. a couple weeks ago. They are okay. Um, a few repercussions. That's all I got out of her text. It was on 128, I-28, however mm -hmm. you pronounce it. And, you know, she has, you know, life issues like everybody else. So I've tried contacting her again, reaching out that we want to unload my car, which is chuck full of prizes. <coughs> um, and you don't want to get pulled over like that. No. So, yeah, with stuffies. Yeah, oh, for I really think you're weird. Yeah, no kidding. So we need to get them out of my car in some place that can be... So I sent a phone message, a text, and an email waiting to hear back from her. So we're going to go from here. We're going to go knock on her door. Can you please take these prizes? Hopefully she'll answer. 
Because I understand why she's not here. I do get that. And I told her that in the email. I, I understand. I get it. But I need to get these out of my car. So you should have cost her with a bunch of stuff. <laughs> in the middle of the night. <laughs> Put them on first. and then. You're not. If not, we They're will not be driving. <laughs> if she doesn't answer the door, we're going to drive to one of these guys' houses, and they're going to store it. I live in the woods. Yeah. So do that's, I. That's why his are better. I have food storing parts to a train. Come on. <laughs> I heard the green What's line new? have some extra parts for you. Huh? Yeah, no kidding. Too right. soon. All right. And, and, and I have a room that's got <clears throat> seven larger than life puppets in it. That I have to keep moving because they're <laughs> in the Imagine way. somebody breaking into your house in the middle of the night. <laughs> Die! <laughs> <laughs> I mean, what is going on? You guys have been to the house. The house is small. There's no I've room never, for this I've stuff. I've never been invited to your house. Okay. Anyway, yeah. rides and games. I will. Rides and games. Well, we were kind of discussing that. I kind of talked about um, the. I made the motion. Trucks. Yeah. Oh. We yeah. should race those downhill by the school. Yeah. We talked about, we talked about and, and cash cube uh, mailing has to go out. They're not out yet. We've been waiting to hear back from Melissa. So we have them in the car. They're printed yeah, up. So she I answers her door. I yeah, printed yeah. up all of the, the letters that get sent out. Are these for donations? Yeah. yeah. Sponsors and donations. Yeah, when them. did we start mailing them? June. No, no. no. <laughs> what <laughs> year? <laughs> what year did we start mailing them? Oh, from day one when we were on board. This is our 24th year. <clears throat> oh, I thought this was a in person. I thought it was an in person. Thing. No, we, no. we it, Tim used to do it in person. It, you would mail something out, then he would We mail something it. out and then He know. was pretty successful, wasn't he? He was very he successful. He was very it also took an immense amount of time. Yeah, he's good like that. And we um, we generally get a pretty good response. <coughs> we'll get we'll get tickets and coupons and, you know. Yeah. Okay. Uh, so we can do a right person. Now. Oh, Foxy Travel, if you'd like to donate something for mm. <laughs> Yeah, I'll give it to you on uh, my profits. Yeah, there you go. So what, you need a mail or something? We I need, need um, yeah. Well, yeah. There's we a, need the list. There's a there's a list of, of um, that should really places be where we send them out. Digitally. Names, addresses, and all that. Like yeah. yeah. Merge. She probably has it digitalized, but we don't have it, and it, it's she, hard it's to really get. Sure to knock on her door. See what happened is if we had at one time no. okay, we, we made this enormous no, list of, of like five hundred places that we sent out a mass text. mailing. Five hundred? Facebook yeah. messages. Okay. Uh, the woman well, no, what what is busy. Is some of them responded. Some of them not. Here, okay? yeah. The ones that responded, yeah. okay, and sent us something, we put them on a different list. See? And then over the course of time that that's the hot list. Yeah. And then when we send a mailing to them, we usually get a response. See that okay. burn on his arm? That's from making the trains. He oh, welded so his arm. Is that, is that, you know, is that, that hurt? Is that what you're going So you with? need someone to send him. <laughs> yes. And, and but we need the list. And bullets is good. I don't know. He just yeah. was making a train. Is it um, because she's been doing <coughs> the ride? I'm not trying to be stuff. smart here. Is it digitized? Most likely, Melissa yeah. has the list yeah. somehow, whether it's an X file or something. We're just, some, we're just uh, having sure a hard it's time an getting Excel a file or something like that. So, side note: we should, for this reason, and because this has happened a couple other ways too, we should think about having a Google folder yeah, or repository folder, yeah. right. where, like, all of this stuff lives, and no one person is the owner. Yeah. For this reason. Well, yeah. you can't. There always has to be an owner. But no, it, it, that's not true. Really? Uh, yeah. I don't know if we would have the capability to do it, but if you've got a shared full down. Yeah, shared you, no, you, you can do that, but mm -hmm. some the creator is usually mm -hmm. still the owner. Mm -hmm. Yeah? Mm -hmm. Okay. All right. We probably can have, so. have that capability. Cause okay, well, at the, at, you know, uh, my school does. We're yeah. going to, we're going to, uh, Along with the prizes that we have now, we're going to give Melissa the opportunity to you know, ask her if she, if she can do this or if she wants to do it. And if not, if she can't for some Wait. reason do it, then we'll that's pull it back and we'll do it. Wait, that's, that's an option. Can somebody ask me if I want to do this? Yeah. You want to do it? You want to do the mass mailing for the prizes? No, I mean any of this. <laughs> do you want the soda jerk? Yeah, okay, soda jerk. moving on. There you go. Okay. Two seventy fifth birthday activities. Is that this year? Oh. What else can we there. do for the birthday? Nothing. 
Oh, around. what about a booklet? <laughs> Yeah. yeah fuck. That's on my list of who's supposed to be doing what. We've been talking about Justin doing this for. No, it's actually not Justin. It is Becky. Who's who's Becky? Justin has turned it over to Becky. But who's a doing it. She works at the library and oh, she's great. a historian type person. She's very excited to do this. We just have to reach out to her again. She is running out of time. Quickly. Yeah. No, there was a there was a deadline. I don't know what it is for her to get articles. There. I guess she had people writing articles. Okay. Okay. Great. Um, there was a deadline that she had given them for getting them. Great. Awesome. Great. So, Let's see what happens. Okay then. What's open for them? Mugs. Wait. Hold Are on. Hold on. Hold on. Two seventieth birth activities. Was that it? We got a question. What can we well, do? Well, also, what else can um, we do? Well, there's that. I Fire said, um, is, is, does anybody else have any ideas for things I that we can do for the birthday? I want the Jinx store to have people walking around <coughs> in historical stop. outfits. Just, stop. just stop. I yield. I just yield stop. the remainder stop. of my time just to stop. Keith. Every time we're like, I want another organization to do this. What happens? We don't have the historical outfits. They did it years yeah, yeah. ago at Oktoberfest. Yeah, they're not going to do it. Hey, you go ahead and ask them. They're not going to do it. Keith had a good idea, though. Fireworks. Fireworks. We don't need anything big. Just, you know, 275. Boom, 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 boom. They won't really be visible at it. Don't you do fireworks at be, night no, at 4 o'clock? Yeah, no, it is. You don't do fireworks at 4 in the afternoon. I understand that. Well, nobody does fireworks in October anyway. Right. So it'll just be a few, like, just bang bangs. And they'll be like, we came downtown for that? No, because it'll be it'll be an added something. And then a bunch of people will be like, but the dogs! And all and, that. And where would you... Where would My you house was caught on fire with the ashes. Where would you do that? That is how. Beer garden, because fireworks and beer always go on. Really? Oh, yeah. That jinx stole will love that. Behind the... Uh, behind no. the main stage. <laughs> I don't know. No. I don't know. I, I haven't... I, I mean, maybe that. shoot a few up yeah, from, from Soldier's, Soldier's Field. Field. Like we're just radio down there, and like at the at the end of event, uh, yeah, at the end of the event, you know, happy 275th, bang, bang, bang. I don't know. I'm winging stuff up. Yeah, there. And that's what that's actually what I wanted. I wanted people to throw ideas out. We, right now, we only have we have a we have. Didn't a, say it was a good idea. <laughs> you said you wanted an idea. I didn't say it was a good idea well, either. Well, <laughs> I, I I wanted people to come up with ideas. We have we have a couple things for you know the the birthday. We have the cake. We have, so we have maybe guests. I have an idea. Huh? What about a, um, a, a prize, like guess the guess the thing and win a prize? Guess well, we already thing. do something like that. We do? Okay. Well, well I don't know because the I oldest person in town. Can we get them out? Do you want to <laughs> <laughs> get them out there? <laughs> okay. They can have the first slice of cake. That's a good idea. The Marines do the oldest and youngest Marine that's at the event for the birthday, Marines birthday ball. The that's oldest person in town gets the first, first slice, slice of cake. I think that's a really good idea. How do would you, you find do that person? We'll, do you we'll, want bring, do we'll bring a blender up. And <laughs> <laughs> do you want Straw. the oldest person who's <laughs> capable of attending the event? I don't know. Again, I'm winging it, and I'm, I'm sure somebody's going to watch this and be like, oh, he's offensive to octogenarians. I, 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 I don't know. I hope it's only an octogenarian. It, it could be Tony for all I know. Tony could be the oldest person in town. I really don't know. You get the first place. I've been reincarnated four times. I'm sure I really am the old person. Uh, we can why are we reincarnated people always someone famous before? Like, uh, why can't it ever just be like, I was Joe? Then you became I didn't Sally, say I was and then you no, I know, but just every time somebody said, like, just fine. Anyway. So, so <laughs> if they were famous before, and okay, they're not yeah. now, they're slumming, right? See you oh, that's true. They, they, they could have gone the wrong way. <laughs> 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 so, all right. So, so far for the for the birthday, yeah, okay, we we we're working on special guests, yeah, right? and and we have the cake, yeah. But what else do we have for that other than at the book, maybe? Right? Fireworks. 
I don't think it's a bad idea. I don't think it's a bad idea either. I think it's You're gonna have to work with the fire department because yeah. What it, what could go wrong? Uh, my house is far enough away. I'm not worried about it. It's not getting dark until like six. I know it's not going to be dark. Like that's what I'm saying is we're not going to do like big light lighting up the flashbangs. We're just going to. I'm saying it's not going to be dark. Maybe it will. You know what? Maybe maybe there'll be a black cloud in our Chardonnay. I, I don't know. Just over your head. I'd like to have another birthday related thing. Town related so you're not, birthday you're, thing. So you're not really going for my fireworks idea, then I guess. I don't know what the balloon. You want to, you want to do a balloon? You want to do like a hot air balloon? I don't even know who to contact for that. The last person that did the hot air balloon was Tony? Cliff Van Reed. Cliff Van Reed, and he did oh, it. Oh, no kidding. And what, the no, last really time cool. it happened, it was very, very Remax. windy, so they had yeah. to they had to stop it from going up in the air. And people became so belligerent and mean that he wow. never brought it back again. Well, now that COVID's come and gone, people are not belligerent anymore. So oh, that's, right. Right. No. that's good. It, it washed away the belligerents. <laughs> really? They're fighting over masks again. Can't we just get them off? Which okay. variant are we going to be on by this one? Uh, it's got to be that's clear. So we're going we're right. to have so it where life is good at this. I would like to come up with some other. How about an ice cream truck? <laughs> okay, we're all getting okay. testy. We can uh, we can think more on this. All right, the thing that we did with we had a really nice big glass and we filled it with candy corn and no pumpkins. We mm. counted the pumpkins and it was a free. Guess how many pumpkins? Two hundred seventy-five. And, what I just said. and we yeah, and we knew what it was, and the person would just fill out the number and tell us what it is, and if. It, it took a while, but this young kid got it, and he was so excited. His family was very excited. He had this like it was like this was enormous huge. brandy glass. That was my idea. That was my idea. Yeah, we did that years ago. You want to do it again? How many what? Yeah, it was a great idea. How many candles are in the jar? Like that already. Hmm? You said we already got something like that. You shot down my idea. No, we're going to do it. We were going to do, do that at the admission table, okay. but we can make something else that's different, sort of like it, but different. But you gotta have more than you can't have two hundred and seventy five. I mean that's kinda like a give away. A little on the nose, yeah. How many candles are in this jar? Two and three quarters. It's just it's just one. It's just a big <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Open forum. Okay. Open forum. Mugs. Are we doing mugs or not this year? Good question. So uh, we're doing mugs? Well we were gonna do Oktoberfest mugs. Yeah, there you go. Put the two hundred and seventy-five. Ah. No, no, no. Two hundred seventy-six. No. So you no. Got two on the nose. No, because then you can't use them next year when we're going to sell. So what? They're still commemorative. People we can do them. some two seventy-fifth, but some most October's. just labeled Oktoberfest. Too um, expensive. Oh God! Just get the two hundred seventy-five. No, D do it. No. They're not. They're not too expensive. Yeah, they're what not that expensive. expensive? Yeah. I don't know. You're gonna do the different thing and everything, right? Minimums, the different artwork. Yeah. Yeah, that's fine. Everybody's printing these things for nothing now. Well, get the ones from I China buy, that I have lab for a bucket really piece. Cheap. What are you getting? Well, they're, they're, not, they're not made of glass. They're black. They're oh. plastic. Uh, yeah. Glass and large no. pencils. Glass. Really well together. Yeah. Um, we did. We remember well, said uh, we sent them to you. That you had choices. Yeah, I don't like them. Okay. You don't like them. Oh, they're plastic. Yeah, they're plastic. It's good for the environment. The turtles love them. <coughs> Do it. 275th. Absolutely. We, you only turn 275 once, John. Bring me stuff. You wait. You wait. When, when you turn. I only turn 275 once. I know. And we're going to you turn 50 next year. I'm we're going to remember year after year <coughs> of, of the 275th with all those extra cups. We'll still use them. Because so what? It's the commemorative cup. You, what, you were the same one. We'll you were the same we'll one saying that I don't want to sell an old book. I don't want to sell the book from two fifty because it went out two fifty. Okay, so we'll buy. The but that's that totally to different. It is different. That's actually. totally different. different. It's different. Do we look into it and send because you? Because no, we don't it's look into new it. New technology. Do it. <laughs> Just, yeah. 
<laughs> anyway, anyway, I'll look up. I'll I'll look up mugs. Okay. And send send everyone and, what you and find I'll, I'll and make a decision from there. So are we gonna do like a like a wild wild Ted's um, Bill and Bill thing Bill's. where you sell no. sell the cup yeah. for yeah. more? No, I don't think we would. Yeah, do that like with a the, um, soda jar. Thing. Yeah, because the soda jar is the soda would cost too much for them to just keep running through. He can sell the mugs there. Yeah. But <coughs> You could sell the mugs at the admission table too. Yeah, it's gonna be five dollars if you want a commemorative mug. That'll be seven. Yeah, come on, right up there, kid. No, you you need to. You be want some cigars, some cigarettes? There you go. Are you twelve? Yeah, here's a pack of Marlboros. On your way. <laughs> you really need to be at the booth with me doing that. <laughs> uh, I wouldn't get any work done. <coughs> okay. Yeah, okay. All right, so you're going to investigate mugs, and if the answer is yes, fine. If no, fine. All right. Okay. You're, you're one, one of us, okay, I'm going to reach out to the, the masons and find out if they're doing German food. I already did. Okay. okay. Oh, Are we have dog racing. Okay. Huh? We have dog racing. Oh, you have things to say about dog racing. Dog racing, yes. What we are you should, going to do dog we racing? We should limit the amount of dogs at the event. <coughs> We yes, have dog racing. There's too many. Knock it off. Okay. Uh, Ron sent me a flyer. They need to be on leashes. No, I will lose my mind. They have to be on leashes. We're going to... Yes, um, because there's a leash law. Leash law. We're going to try to get um, uh, more entrance to the uh, dog racing. How many entrants do you have now? I don't know. <laughs> How do they apply for that? Not me. They go through dog orphans. Through dog orphans. Yeah. So, and we have some contacts where we can kind of try and goose up those numbers, but we just maybe John's working on it. <coughs> I'm working on it. So what are they? I'm going to get you like a rubber pencil. Like what do they? What do they win for? I live with them. What do they win for prizes? For Same thing as the other year. Although we're we're trying to see if we can get them another prize. But like I said, we, just, we just need more. We we just need more info from Doc Orphans right now. And John's gonna call them again tomorrow morning to see what he can do. I got a flyer. You yeah, got we, a flyer? We, no. All right. Good. Also, when we talked about the no, tricycle, we're, we're the just races. gonna do that. Like, we'll just sell tickets and let them. Do that. We're not going to turn that into an event. Now. You should. You should do. You should. You should try to do a couple like event times and see if you can get like the firefighters to race the policemen or something. Are we talking about the trikes? Yeah. So like a selectman's race, like. Yeah, you could have some fun with that. I think that's. I think we want to. Um, and, and it, 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 they're going to be timed, right? Yeah, so you have to have the no. like, best time of the day. No, they're not going to be timed. That's not, if, not, if we op not if we sell tickets and we open it up just it's to be people open. riding around. Riding around. Yeah. Which is what it's going to be most of the day. Yeah. Right. What, what's the other part of the day that it's well, not? Well, uh, that's what well, originally we planned that we were going to do races there and then we were going to let them. You know, so my two, uh, my, my couple concerns yeah. with doing races, I want to. We don't know what the course is actually going to look like, mm -hmm. and if it's like wide enough and stuff to so like pass. Is yeah, even better. Um, that's one. Two is just the logistics of yeah. getting people to announce it, people to sign up. So you know up. what? This year, just do open racing, and yeah. then you know see how it goes. And the next year, maybe we, we almost like yeah. treat people like dogs. Yeah. And have now I did buy. I do have a set of spare wheels. Oh, that's good. Yeah, you know, because they tear up the back wheels, right? If, when you when you go crazy, you tear up the back wheels. So I bought a set, an extra set of wheels to replace if if they worn too thin. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Um, but they're they're awesome. They're glass. <laughs> we should um, test them some evening before the event. We should do what? We should test them some test evening them? before the event. Really? In the parking lot, we'll set up some cones yeah. and do some testing. Okay. 
it's ear to ear fun. Right. Hey, yeah. him and I raced around and they yeah, are, they are fun. Yeah, Tony's fast. Awesome. Yeah, he was breathing pretty hard after. But yeah. I wasn't breathing hard. He was breathing hard. <laughs> yeah, right. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Anything else? I don't think so. I think we're um, we're ready. Motion to adjourn. Um, I will entertain oh. it. Thank you. However, you don't want to hit more than clicky pens. Um, if if we keep to really don't wear if we keep to our our current meeting schedule, okay, Ooh. then we have four more meetings before we're done. Oh, did you hear that? You hear that? So four more meetings. Yeah. So if we keep to our normal meeting schedule, we have four more meetings before the event, all in September. Should we do okay? one because meeting Because this is again? August. I would like to do another meeting this month. Yeah. Okay. The last Tuesday of August? Yeah. It would may, may probably, well, if the last week in August would mean we'll have five meetings in a row. Okay? So we could probably, I'm, unless we really don't have anything to discuss, but, but there are a couple of open items. Whatever is not highlighted has to be done. That's right. All right. Well, send me the volunteer thing, and I'll start getting that up on Facebook. All right. So, so we are, I we are, I am going to try to schedule another meeting this month, but we don't have to do it today. Okay. So we'll. Um, <laughs> I didn't catch it. All of a sudden, I just saw these two uh, laughing. But these two guys like they up were the ten years old. Themselves. They have a secret. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, I didn't do it. I don't know what you yes, guys. You, did. Did. you totally did. You don't even know it. Oh my god! The clicky clickies. <laughs> I have a motion to adjourn. Do we have? Wait, I was uh, no. You two, yeah, no, you two, was, and like, then I was and doing then it. You started, <laughs> started, started, like, click, click, click. Okay, I'm okay. Sorry. Okay. <laughs> Please don't. Yeah. Okay. All right. So we are going to have another meeting this month. I just don't know when yet. I okay. have to click it to bring the pen out. Okay. I'm, All right. I'm prepared. Okay. okay. So we have okay. a motion to adjourn. No. No. You have what? You have more stuff. something out. What I did? I motion to. Do adjourn. you have? Do you have? No. No. We have to discuss the town common lighting if we're doing oh, it. Okay. No, we're not. It's dead. Done. Over no, it's it. not. Totally over it. No, it's not. I'm over it. Was, it. It, was, it was totally handed over. All of it was handed over to us. Uh, when? Last voting time or whatever it was. No, no. no um, we still have, okay. Uh, all right. All right. Here's, here's the thing. I, I know she says that. <coughs> yes, she talked to somebody and said, "Okay, yeah, you can have it." Yeah, that, that's and then and then a week before Thanksgiving, they're gonna they got they got all the lights and they're gonna decorate the common again. Yeah, there is no, they have really don't have a committee. There's no committee. They, it's just a group yeah. of people together no, that calling themselves a committee. I'm over it. Okay, so I got I got I, I do my swater ski thing in December now. I, I don't I don't have time, patience, effort to park okay. up this tree anymore. I, I, I would love to do a, a, a Christmas thing there where we light no, up the common. You're out of the conversation. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> that's fine. No, yeah. Did cool. we just talk about it? Huh? What just happened? <laughs> I'm out. I know you want to do it. Yeah. Huh? I know you want to do it, but isn't there a barrier to entry? Well, the barrier entry is, is, that, is that they don't have a committee that's responsible for it. They're responsible for the... the Tony's talking about a hostile takeover. And yet they're still doing yeah. it. So <coughs> no, she only did it last year. So there was something on, not the trees. They did just stop. They did I'm stretching. I have a kink <laughs> in my neck. They did just the gazebo itself. So there was something there, but they have. They're no longer. They only did it just so there's something. Uh, that it's done. I mean, so it was handed over to us, but it was too late last year to follow yeah, through yeah, and make but, it happen. But but. It's handed over to us, but not. There's nothing official saying that. So, so we can't really get involved in planning something unless we know absolutely guaranteed that that there's something. There. Yeah. Okay. Well, right now we just got somebody saying, "Yeah, you can do it," and then that, but that can change tomorrow when you have the other person on this committee say no. So, <coughs> it's not. What it, you? It, it's not. At one point you were going to reach out to the 
selectmen or yeah I did mention it to him but it, nothing happened from that okay so I'm gonna have to I, I got another name so maybe I can get um, some some action but I will do that but that's what's gonna happen first is that they have to have a real committee that are responsible to someone mm -hmm. are you interested in doing this or not because he's no so I'll, I mean I'll, I'll do it okay so we needed to know if we're going to actually go further with this, or is it just... I mean... I would like to set... Yeah. My, my yeah. idea was is that I would like to set up lights, a light Christmas light show there. Yep, okay. we talked about that. Yep, with the, at certain times of the day it does certain things. And it doesn't have to, because it can all be wireless, <coughs> the music. It doesn't have to affect... Um, yeah, it it doesn't have to affect you know we have an FM the neighbors and all that. What we have an FM transmitter. Yeah. Tune into a station. Yeah. So, but in order for us to invest in that kind of thing, it can't be just a hack ad hoc committee over there that says yes this time and no the next time. So I think there's a couple barriers. You keep looking at me. I'm out. There's a couple barriers to entry to this. One is the committee, right? That's one. Two is the timing. And we ran for two reasons. One, we run up against Uxbridge and their first, yep. first, night. first night. And then the other one we run into is just timing, like uh, the, the time to do it and decorate it and then do it, right? Mm -hmm. It's like not too long after this. Mm -hmm. And it's holidays, but everyone's busy. Um, I think. The Oxbridge thing is a pretty big issue. It's hard to work around because yep. that's not going to go anywhere. No. And it's their signature event. Yeah. Like yeah. Like, yeah. It'd be like Oxbridge you know, doing something on October 3rd. Yeah. Yeah. Like, yeah. And, so, and that's not going to change. Did they have it listed? But none of, Oxford first first night is? none of the things are movable, right? Thanksgiving is not movable. Oxford's first night is not going to move. And right. so after that, we're, we're left with, what, two weeks before, three weeks before Christmas? Mm -hmm. So the timing is never going to change. That's something to be considered. Um, the committee thing might move, and it might change, and if it does, we maybe entertain it. But um, the timing-wise is really something to, to work as a workaround. Yeah. Um, I mean, I like the idea. I'm all on, on board. I think it's a great idea. Um, I mean, we've also talked about a summer movie series. I think that would be another great way to expand mm -hmm. and do, you know, one, two, three movie nights in the town in the summer. I think that'd be awesome. Probably an easier lift in a lot of ways mm -hmm. than with town lighting. So, I don't know, what do you, why do you feel so strongly about the common light? I don't. I'm just saying that if we do it, if we do it... Do you feel like, do you feel like because it's empty, like some, we should be doing something about it? Yeah, part of me said so. Like, it, or are you looking you to... Know, every other town is all decorated up nice, you know, for, for Christmas. Um, or are you just bored? It's just that, well, it, it, it fell by the wayside by not being followed through um, in, in one year. And then last year they did it, but there was never flip the switch. So you, under the circumstances of COVID and all that, I understand. But it used to be a thing where they didn't. Everyone would be excited about it. And then it just kind of because of who's yeah. going to do it, who's not going to do it. I have the lights, I don't have the lights. It got complicated. So that's why if, if we are gonna do it, then we are to, we are doing it. Yeah. I mean, yeah. <laughs> John, I just read your note. <laughs> well, it, 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 you know, it, it, it's four. You can't find it. Too. Yeah, so yeah the last thing it's only four of us here. For so for us to take on another event, okay, with with no volunteers and no help, it's hard. Also. Yeah. 
Yeah, and this is not, it's not a huge event, or it wouldn't be a huge event, but there's some logistics. Mm. Take some manpower. <coughs> um, if we don't want to do it, then we don't want to do it. I mean, so. Yeah, I mean, if you're bored and you're looking for oh, more things to do, then you're I would, um, we just know, added to our list. I'd rather put our weight behind the summer movie series than our tree lighting. Maybe the first Congo could do it because they're right there. Not our problem. Hmm? That's not our problem. You're both looking at me and you both have opposite opinions. Keith is totally out and I'm like, um, I'm. I mean that's kind of that's the core issue is that it's not our it's not our space yeah. yeah and if we sort of tried to elbow ourselves into it and we got you know we got sucked into it and so I think we learned well, right we now the learn. structure of it's not not good enough for us to get in anyway it's what it's not it's not conducive for us to get involved in it anyway um, because there's just too much uncertainty there's nobody in charge over there so yeah I mean it's not really our space yeah. okay now I'll take a motion to adjust so moved again. Second. All in favor? Aye. Aye. We're done.